Go. Okay, you guys are all set? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. My name is uh, Mr. Campbell, and I'm from Nadikoli High School. And these are my colleagues. This is a professional learning community, my co workers. And so I wanted to introduce this is Pam, this is Brian, and this is Shannon. And what we're going to do today, I'm going to show them how to create a web page. This is something that's very good there in the library as well as computer. And so creating a spreadsheet would be very helpful so that uh, you can do, you know, like your textbook inventory, get it all online. All right, and so all that uh, inventory uh, is uh, it's a very important thing to know. Uh, it's very practical. Uh, we do this in science. Uh, there, uh, it's just a way of collecting data and storing data. All right, and so uh, first you need your Google account, and you already are on your Google account, and you went to the drive. And as you see on the drive, I want over here on the left side is what we manage, okay? So what I would like you to do is with your cursor is to click on, all right, just put your cursor right on the create, all right, and you see there are various uh, documents uh, types that you can create. We can create a folder, a document, a presentation, or a spreadsheet. Those are the main ones. And would you go down and click on spreadsheet? Okay, and so this gives you the spreadsheet. It's very much exactly like uh, manipulating uh, Microsoft Word Excel. All right, and so if, you have, if you're familiar with that, you'll be an expert on this, okay? So you see, it is a nice a spreadsheet, and so now you can create your data. All right, now uh, you can uh, just, uh, uh, let's say we're going to put some labels on it. So right now, as you open it, you see that it's uh, the there's a big box outlined by blue, all right, and it is um, A on box A1, okay? All right, uh, let's uh, title that, something that you want to do. Let's uh, say uh, um, physical science textbooks, okay? Physical science textbooks. And you want to uh, type that in there. All right, and um, if, and I'm sure it is, the name is a little bit too big for the space, and it went down. Uh, we can make that space uh, longer, just exactly like Microsoft Excel. So if you take the, your cursor and put it right in between uh, A and B, and double click that, all right, and it'll jump and it'll make it uh, a nice big uh, column, so that's single, okay? All right, and so now I got a big stack of, uh, of textbooks, okay? Now we got to go in and the teachers are going to do their inventories. Uh, this is something that even uh, we can have them, uh, the teachers to do, all right, now that we have one-on-one -on -one, uh, computers. And so uh, it's just part of, part of the policies and procedures. Okay? Uh, so just some, some ideas that we can uh, think about. All right, and so uh, the first one, all right, uh, everything, uh, the textbook is um, uh, edited in 2008. So 2008, the first book I see is uh, 01. So it would be 2008-1, all right, and then 2008-2. Those are the two books we have so far. So go ahead and uh, create in 2A, just type in 2008-1. O one, and you hit that, enter it. The next textbook is two thousand eight o two. All right, we're missing two thousand eight o three. Okay, but the next one is two thousand eight o four. So try that. So this is very good. And as you uh, see down here, uh, there is sheet one. Click that little cursor. All right. And you see down there that uh, we can copy it, we can name it, we can uh, uh, do some other things uh, for that. All right. Uh, but that's just one way how we can 
uh, save our data. All right. You guys have any questions on it so far? Everything good? Okay, very good. Uh, this is just an example that uh, we, we uh, uh, did in uh, science, and uh, we use this in science to create data tables and graphs. That's not necessarily the application that we want to go on to now. Uh, it was more lengthy, uh, but uh, it was just uh, some practical things that you can use with spreadsheets. Thank you. Cut.